Hey guys, how are you? Hope you're all doing very well. Spanish Jones 669, Friday Review for the House of Horror. The film I've chosen to review for you this Friday is a horror film from Slovakia. Slovakian language English subs, released in the year 2012, directed by Peter Babiak, and this film is called Evil. Now, Evil is about this TV show that is kind of struggling to make ends meet, and they need a big story. So they go to this haunted hotel, and they start to believe that maybe it's not so haunted. So they get word of a haunted house. And so this is a much better um, environment to be in, and they see this as an opportunity to get some ratings. So they go to this house, and this is where this really strange owner starts telling them about what's been happening, and it has something to do with his wife, uh, who has since passed away. So they see this as an opportunity. They set up in his house, and he basically has a change of heart. He says, no, 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 get out of my house. It's not right. So this ultimately gets the curiosity of these filmmakers, and they return to the house when he basically leaves. So this is where they realise that the deep dark secret this guy has been trying to protect them from is deadly. And whether or not this crew can get out of this ordeal in one piece is something you're going to have to find out for yourself because that's as far as I'm going with my synopsis. Now my thoughts on Evil. Uh, I was really, really impressed with this film. I thought this was a great horror film. It is basically a haunted sort of house film, but it's so much different. It's so much better. It reminded me of Spanish films such as Wreck. If you like Wreck and you like the fast-paced atmosphere of Wreck, you're going to like Evil. I just thought that it takes a very tired sort of plot and it just spins it to make it really freaky. It's a very scary film and I thought the character of the guy who owned the house was really good. He's a lot of mysterious quality to him and when the bad things start to happen, he kind of turns into someone different. So I just thought... No one talks about Evil, which is a great shame. It's a very little-known horror film, and apparently it hasn't been released officially outside of Slovakia. So it took my good friend Magnus, Vault Keeper 2, a Swedish YouTuber, to send me a copy because it's just a great shame this hasn't been released, and it deserves so much recognition because it's so good. Cinematography is excellent. It just captures a really, really dreaded atmosphere and you feel that whatever's hiding is really sinister and when the big things start to happen boy do they happen it's a, just a roller coaster of just scares there's a lot of jump scares there's a lot of suspenseful build up so it's combining a lot of subgenres and it's just making it an awesome experience so if you don't mind reading subtitles I would highly recommend you check out Evil uh, the soundtrack is pretty cool it doesn't rely on force feeding you the what you should be feeling so it doesn't cue the scary music when scary things are happening there's a little bit of gore in it for good measure but it doesn't rely on the gore what it relies on is really good old fashioned suspense and just really good jump scares uh, you kind of you can't really predict when they're going to happen but when they happen you just feel like you're watching a really good horror film so i thought the ending was absolutely fantastic as i said it reminded me a little bit of spanish films such as wreck um, just that sort of really dreaded environment and it's not often that you come across horror films like this and it's an even bigger surprise that a horror film like this is known from Slovakia and no one talks about it so hopefully after this review you want to go out there and see because I thought this is fantastic and so overall I'm going to give this film four and a half stars I thought it was great and it is coming highly highly recommended all right guys that's my review hope you enjoyed it till next week keep watching horror and I'll see you later bye, -bye.